So in today's class, uh, we are going to discuss about internationalization. So that's a concept. Uh, so making your portal applications available in multi languages. So we uh, use a process called a resource bundle here. So we maintain a, a, a bundle for each language and uh, depending upon the language uh, the corresponding bundle will be loaded at runtime say if it is a, the language is English then English bundle will be loaded or if it is German German bundle will be loaded so it's a, we use a Java uh, internationalization concept here so portal adapted the same concept where uh, the resource bundle class uh, uh, the util package will be used and get local method it, it provides uh, uh, get local method provides you know uh, the language uh, local specific language so so based on uh, uh, the local a, a corresponding bundle will be loaded here so we have to create a bundle for each language uh, so let's uh, do an example on internationalization uh, so let's uh, let's do you know in the previous example in our previous class we have discussed about personalization so we can use the same project and we can convert the personalization project to internationalization. So the demo on two underscore personalization, this is what we have done in the last class. So let's do an internationalization uh, uh, project uh, example on this project. So to begin with, uh, we need to create resource bundles first. So resource bundle is a property file, uh, Java property file. It contains, uh, you know, text. Uh, so label uh, and uh, language equal and text will be there so let's create uh, three property files each for one language so normally the property files are created in portal uh, DAS under DAST portal INF you can see localization folder here uh, we create uh, the property files so before creating the property files uh, because uh, we need to create a name of the resource bundle in the portal app.xml file under component config. So open your portal app.xml file source under component configs, add component config property. You can say add standard and you can find resource bundle name here. Okay. And add the name of the bundle. Say my bundle finish and you can see the property was added here this was bundle name and my bundle so now with this property my bundle we have to create you know property files so property file should start with the name of the bundle my bundle so my bundle dot properties is a default English file, you know, default English file, and if it is a German, my bundle underscore de dot properties. So that's how we create property files for each language. So based on uh, this value, it can be anything here. The value. So if you put, let's say, if you put uh, test test bundle, then your property files should start with starts start with test bundle. So let's add property files under localization folder here. So right click new I'm going to create you know property files here for each language other select simple file next so name of the property file uh, so the name as I told you the name should start with my bundle here the value what we provided in portal app.xml so my bundle there are properties finish this is a default English property file and copy this create one one more bundle for uh, German paste in the same folder and rename it so you can say my bundle underscore D per German so now we have two files here property files and let's copy one more let's paste one let's create one more and this time let's say this is Ian and you can say French FR 
Okay. So we have uh, by default we have English. It loads by default. English will be loaded and German and we have French. So three files we have. These are empty. Let's add. Uh, let's add some text here. So let's add favorite uh, color. color is and let's add one more property pet name another property home So these are the labels I, and we added text for these labels here and save this one. So add the same in the German property file and just put the German equivalent text in the right, right hand side. So favorite color, add the German text here. Normally uh, in the in real time environment, if, uh, translators will provide you these property files so the developer you don't have to worry about this one so when you are working on a multi-language projects multi-language portal projects translators will be employed and they'll provide you uh, the language specific uh, English equivalent text say for English equivalent and text the German translator will provide you you know German equivalent so like that they employ uh, translators so favorite color so add German equivalent pet name home so that's the German you can copy and put it in a French file the third one so let's add some French text here. Save. Now you can see all these property files 